Wait, should I use soap, bleach, or alcohol to protect myself from the Ebola virus? Yes, Jojo, that's a great question. You should absolutely use bleach, alcohol, and soap to eliminate the Ebola virus. Uh, bleach is best used on countertops and any uh, furniture that you might have in your house. And it's really good at killing the Ebola virus because it actually breaks down the protein capsin that encases the Ebola virus, making it completely unable to interact with your cells. Alcohol is a great way to kill the Ebola virus if you don't have access to soap and water. It essentially interferes with the virus's membrane so that it cannot bind to your cell's membrane and introduce itself into your cells. And soap and water is by far the best way to get the Ebola virus off of your hands or off of your skin altogether. What soap does is it can actually interfere with the cell's membrane or with the virus's membrane much like uh, alcohol does. However, on top of that, it can actually form what's called a micelle with the soap particles attaching to the capsin of the, the virus and it can actually wash it completely off of your hands, meaning that not only is the virus unable to bind with your cells, it's also now no longer on your hands at all. So if you have access to soap and warm water, this is the best solution for washing your hands. Okay, so I can use bleach to wipe down any countertop to protect against the Ebola virus. While I'm at it, I might as well sanitize my hands with bleach because it's more effective than alcohol, right? That's a good question. Uh, but no, you definitely should not use bleach on your skin. And the reason for this is bleach is much more concentrated than alcohol is. And while alcohol can't permeate the dead skin layer that you have on your, your skin, bleach can. And it actually seeps directly through that layer of dead skin and can reach your live skin cells. And while it's extremely effective at killing the Ebola virus, it can actually do the same thing to your skin cells as it does to the Ebola virus, which is interfere with your membrane and actually break down the proteins in your cells. This can cause extreme burns on your skin that can last forever, and it can even cause nerve damage and other irreversible effects on your skin. So while it's good to use on your countertops to eliminate the Ebola virus, it is not safe to use on your body, your skin, to ingest, or any other facet of that.